Look how wonderful I look this morning. <laughs> Good morning, guys. <clears throat> Welcome to the vlog. It is actually 11.38, so it's not morning. But I had a terrible, mm, I had a really rough, rough night. Um, I woke up with my stomach hurting, and I thought it was a repeat. And so I was like, oh my gosh. And Cora is sick, and she's running a fever, so I thought, whatever. Whatever she's got, I must have. And so anyway, I went to the couch and tried to, you guys, trying to sleep on the couch. What a joke when you have cats. So I get there. Boo climbs on me. Sorry, it's bright. I'm going downstairs after I embroider a shirt. Um, Boo climbs on me. And it's going to be dark. Gets all over me. And I'm like, you know, my stomach hurts and you're like climbing on me. So then, I mean, she probably laid with me probably 10, 15 minutes. And then she leaves. And then Junebug comes. And Junebug wants under the blankets. So I'm like, oh my gosh. So I let her in. She snuggles for a little bit. She's like a cuddly cat. Um, she's kind of like Ron. Ron was really cuddly. Um, so then, this is going to be a noise. I have to turn this on. <sighs> then she leaves. Okay. And so I'm like, okay, whatever. And I'm trying to go to sleep. I was cold. Again, same thing, you know, like when I was sick last week. Um, a week ago, basically. Um, I had kind of the chills and I was like do I have food poisoning again is it just a sickness you know I don't know so then I fall asleep and I wake up to guitar noises and I'm like oh the heck's playing the guitar and it wasn't like like a song it was just like ding 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 kind of like that and I was like and I look, and Winnie is strumming a guitar in the middle of the night. I'm like, number one, what are the odds that a cat's going to be playing guitar? And number two, what are the odds that she's going to continue to pluck at a guitar? Number three, why is she playing a guitar in the middle of the night while I'm sleeping on the couch? Like, and... And I know I wasn't dreaming, and I'm like, I can't, it pissed me off, but I was just like, so then finally I fall back to sleep, and I wake up to someone attacking my feet, and their little claws piercing, which reminds me, I'm like, do I got, oh, there is a scratch there on my leg, I'm like, it was Junie, Junebug, I'm like, what, Anyway, regardless, I slept, so I was awake for, you know, a few hours during the night. One, because my stomach was hurt and I couldn't go back to sleep. And two, because I had things waking me up, cats waking me up. And then, um, so I finally woke up. It was around 10. Actually, I take it back. I woke up around 8.39 because of journey came in the living room and so she got and crawled in in with me on the couch and she just laid there for a while anyway I finally got off the couch around 10 a.m. so I feel a bit groggy and then I went and laid on the bed and you know I always like to like check my phone in the morning like see if I had any orders or you know so I did that and my husband's like, well, I'm going to take a shower. Oh, and I had messages I had to answer, so. Um, and he was like, something about getting a coffee. I was like, well, I have to go make that shirt. <laughs> like, All right, well, we won't get a coffee. And he's like, but I need to take out the trash. And then he's like, well, I might as well go get a coffee since I have to take out the trash. Anyway, that's where they went. And I'm downstairs to work on this order. I had to get, I was completely out of 
bobbins. So they're so expensive too. They used to be around forty dollars a box, and now I think this one was like forty-eight. But like with anything, everything's just gonna go up and like. I always cut. Let me just leave it like this. And cut the things off. So. Anyway, now I'm gonna work on the shirt. And hopefully he'll come home with me. Me coffee. And it will make. Wake me up. And I just posted the video. So. Hey guys. So it's time to start dinner. And I'm hoping my ham will fit. <laughs> You see what I got. Um, so I saved our ham bone from yesterday. There's a lot of meat on it. In addition, I pulled all the meat. All the meat we had cut up, I stuck in here too. But let's see what we got. Um, we don't need everything. Yeah, it'll work. Should I throw these other pieces in here? Maybe I'll just freeze them. That's what I'll do. I'll just stick them in the freezer for my next meal and soup. So, um, I told my husband because he was like, "Should I go? You know, throw this out?" And I was like, "No." I was like, "Look at all the meat and stuff on that. We can make a good bean soup." So, that's what I'm going to do today. Because we've got that, I'm just going to add water. Um, normally when I make bean soup, I use like chicken stock or chicken broth or beef broth or bone broth. But Three quarts of water, I think. And as it cooks, I might add more. Um, we'll just see what we got. So I'm gonna cut up some onion and celery. And let's see what beans I've got. I always got beans. So we've got what is this? black eyed peas. Oh, what's this? What's this? What's this? We've got great northern beans. We've got navy beans. I usually have a 15 bean. I've got pencil beans. I think we're gonna go with some great northern. So let me rinse my beans real quick. Okay, so I rinsed them. I'm just making sure there's no rocks or anything. Go ahead and cut up some celery and onion. Okay, take that in. I added a large onion. I'm making the girls' French fries in the air fryer, so that's not always. But I added celery and my onion. And I add some garlic. Just about two. Garlic, 
this is my Dollar Tree garlic. <laughs> so. Now, I'm going to add about a teaspoon of chili powder. So, I'm just going to add just a little bit of chili powder. That's enough. Um, I think that's all I'm going to add. Oh, I need some bay leaves up in this thing. dry bay leaves. Here's a nice one. Alright. Well, that's all I'm going to add right now. Um, I will also add some of my canned carrots later. And let's add a little pepper. And then, um, I might, no, actually I'm not. I was going to say I might add a can of tomatoes, but I don't think I am. And that's it. I'm going to cover and cook it on high. I have it set for six hours, but it'll probably take a little bit longer now. That's it. Okay, hello. So... We are now at 2.21 in the afternoon. Grand Pam is still in her jams, and she probably will be until at least, let's say four, or sh I don't know. I have a lot of orders. Um, I'm trying to get my water in. But, um, yeah, so getting up late threw me off. I had a rush order, I had to finish. It's done left with my husband. Um, I went up, made Journey lunch, she just had french fries, and then I started the dinner, which was bean soup, and then I went outside in my jams, and, uh, checked on the chickens, made sure they had water and food, um, filled up their water, and, um, they actually have enough food for today, I will need to fill it up probably, if not, if I don't do it this evening, tomorrow, um, I mean, they have enough. They had like good two or three inches in there. So I have a gravity feeder. So they, you know, they had a good amount. I usually just kind of shake it because what happens is they peck. Um, so it's a little space that they peck all the stuff out of. And sometimes it gets clogged and it doesn't, you know, go all the way down. So I usually like shake it up. And that helps get some of the. The stuff that's stuck because they have like little seeds and corn pieces and stuff. And so anyway, yeah, so I have a lot of orders um, that are due to ship. Hold on, we missed the call. Welcome to the vlog, Kelsey Carter shirt. I should have bought another one another Kelsey Carter shirt for backup when I wear this one out um, so I made chicken chicken salad again you guys we are not sick of it um, this is probably like the fifth or sixth week in a row I don't even know I was trying to think I think fifth because um, I made chicken broth I usually use about two uh, things to make chicken broth, and it makes a lot of chicken broth. Eee! Splashing myself. Anyway, so almost slipped. Um, but then I would have had two last week, but then I went and looked for my bones, and my husband had thrown my bones away. <laughs> so. Anyway, I'm 
just we already ate our chicken salad. Journey didn't eat her, so but that's what we had for lunch. And I am cleaning up the bones here, getting more meat off them, the dark meat and stuff, and making chicken salad. And then we'll eat this for lunch again tomorrow. It is too funny though because like I would think that my husband would be getting sick of it because we have it like once a week now. Um, but when we were grocery shopping, he was like, "Are you gonna buy a chicken? One of those chickens?" <laughs> I was like, "I was like, uh, you know, I kind of thought about it because I kind of want it." And he was like, "Yeah, that was really good. Yeah." And I was like, "Okay, as long as you're not getting sick of it." So, yeah. So we can eat. So a chicken is $5.97 for a rotisserie, rotisserie chicken at Walmart. We just get the traditional one. And um, I always have celery um, for different recipes. And then we got some grapes. And honestly, um, so I made it with last week. We had some green grapes, but they were really sour. So he's like, don't make it with those, because those are sour. So we just did it with apples. And I'll be 100% honest with you, I prefer it with these uh, red grapes, or purple grapes, or whatever these are. Um, so yeah, and we were eating it. I was like, it's so much better with these. He's like, yeah, it just, it gives it that, just that little kick like you need. Um, now I will say the apples were good, but I think I just prefer cats are fighting. By fighting, I mean playing, but Winnie takes everything so seriously and she'll probably start. There she goes. Hey! She jumped on the table. We don't want our animals on the table, on the counters. Um, I know some people do and that's, that's them you know, to each their own, but we do not allow cats on the counter or table, mainly because they, you know, they step in their kitty litter and they're peeing their poop and, yeah. And there was, oh my gosh, you guys. So my husband was telling me about um, somebody he knows. I don't remember who it was, but he was like, they were like in college or something and it might have been Julie's roommate um, but he was like eating like cheese whiz on crackers and like spraying the cheese whiz and then they had a cat and he was letting the cat lick it and then he ate it and my husband was like that's gross he's like what cat's mouths are cleaner than ours and my husband was like yeah but a cat can lick its own butthole I can't <laughs> Needless to say, the guy was like grossed out. I guess he didn't ever think about that. I don't know. But pretty gross. Pretty gross if you ask me. So here's my chicken salad. So we just like celery, grapes, and mayonnaise. And then we do salt and pepper. And it's delicious. And we've been liking it on the sweet Hawaiian rolls. Um, it would be, I think it would be good on sourdough, honestly. But I need to make some. I just, I probably don't have, I mean, I probably do have enough just, you know, to make some sourdough, but I kind of like there to be a lot. I gave it a bath and did all that yesterday. Anyway, the kitchen is, in, it always looks like this on Tuesdays. Because we, it's, you know, we got stuff from the weekend and then groceries. So everything is just everywhere. And so I need to clean up. Sterling asked if I was going to go to the thrift store. I really don't know. Probably not. Uh, I got some dirt. I bought some seeds. Like I need more seeds. Where are they? Here they are. We got freaking fly in here. 
he needs to go. Bye bye. I'm like, it's not fly season. Why are you in here? Anyway, um, so they had little displays in the garden scent section at Walmart that had some of these 50 cent seeds. So I bought. Um, they're all, they're most of them are flowers, so I just bought a few, um, ones that the girls and I are going to try to grow. Oh, they had asparagus. I didn't think I bought any asparagus in the vegetables that I have, so I went ahead and got that. Oh, and spinach. Sterling's a spinach girl, so. And then I have never saw these little dwarf teddy bear sunflowers so. and then more sunflowers I have enough sunflowers to last me probably throughout my entire life but you know so oh apparently I got some more Still, <laughs> more, sunflowers. more sunflowers I thought I put one of them back you did oh well then I did I got more too uh, so, and then I did buy um, the sweet peppers because I don't think I had any peppers. So I have a ton, I mean, I have enough seeds to probably last me forever between these seeds and those seeds. And I also found a bag of seeds that I have down there. Uh, these ones are sell by 12.24. Although it says sell by, just so you know, they still will sprout, and they will stay, even if it's after. Um, I think last year the sunflowers I planted out there were from, I don't remember how many years ago. But I'm going to uh, put my chicken salad in the fridge, get this place cleaned up. We got to do school. I got to work on those shirts. I want to do some plants, maybe do some starters. the kitchen the best I could. I mean, wiped everything down, got the fridge clean. But right, I'm gonna go run to the post office and I'm going to, the girls talked me into going to the thrift store. <laughs> Talk me into it. So we're gonna go do that real quick, come back, and then we're gonna start school. We're having fajitas for dinner, so um, there's not a lot of prep for that, which I'm glad, it's just, grilling all the vegetables and then I gotta come home and um, fill up my chicken and I'm still I'm waiting on babies you guys I heard cheeps yesterday and at least one of the eggs the other one I'm pretty sure I did but, so I'm waiting on babies oh and then you guys Walmart so I got some soil and then Walmart um, had these guys they need water desperately I'm gonna water them real quick right now but yeah 
and we're gonna plant them. So I've got the soil. I'm just gonna do it in the put her shoes over here. I'm just gonna do it in the front. some garlic. I, there's some asparagus over there and now they want some garlic. Stopped at Starbucks. We're getting black tea lemonades. What? I don't see nothing. You don't see nothing? I don't see nothing on you either. Oh, I can see me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> We're checking the post office. Got it. Get it in there. She's trying to check the peel box. You gotta push it all the way in. You got a key. Now what do you do? Now you go over here and find out which one, what number's on the key. Okay, we'll find number four. Here it is. Let's open. It goes in the bottom. The bottom one. This one? Bottom. This? Yes. Yeah, I was looking for my keys and Strong's like, someone's calling you. Oh, wait a minute. You're calling someone.
You gotta put it in, baby. But we just went to the thrift store and then we went and got a Starbucks. You gotta turn the key. This? Yeah. I am. The other way. Towards the wall. It's a box. Can you just leave that? Yeah, you leave the key in there. What? Wow. Somebody got a package from Snowbird. Hi, guys. So, right there. I'm going to open the package Diana. from Diane. I was talking to my sister. My phone died. <laughs> so she probably thinks I hung up on her. She probably knows. People know me. My phone's never charged. Watch out, baby. I don't want to cut you. After this, we're going to do school, and then we're going to start fajitas. Actually, I'm going to go downstairs and put something on. Oh. Yay! Yay! Oh, let me try not to show address. So we went to Starbucks. Let me tell you, we went to Starbucks, right? There was a bunch of people there, but we walked up, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, we walked up to, you know, get in line and like, we're just standing there and the girl's just standing there. And you know, normally when you, there's something on my lens, hold on. Normally when you um, go up, you know, they're like, Hi, welcome to Starbucks, you know, or, so I'm like, stop, please. So I'm standing there and I'm waiting and she's just like, so I'm like thinking there's something wrong with her registers or they're trying to, you know, so I'm like just standing there. I stood there for the longest time and then finally she's like, you ready to order? And I'm like, but I felt like almost like like they i won't say didn't want to wait on me but it was like they were like <laughs> you know mumbling and talking to each other like i'm just gonna stand here and let this girl wait i don't know what they said honestly but i was at the point of where i was ready to walk out like but then people started lining up behind me so there was a you know i'm thinking we can stand here all day there you're gonna get a big line of people and I'm like, if you are, you know, Mom? I don't know what she was waiting for. You know this what I mean? The water one or food? Water one or food? That's for food. I picked this up, so. Um, this is what I picked up at the thrift store. It was three bucks at Tractor Supply. I think these are two ninety seven, and the bottom pieces are two ninety seven. You buy them separately. Um, I don't know what's on there, but I'm gonna clean it off. But it's for food. We got chicks that are Yay! going to be hatching out soon and there is one yeah that's that hatching, is hatching right now hatching right now so by the end of the day we should have at least one baby chick um if not more anyway so i got this we're gonna open Give this me. hold on i'm gonna Give read that note that i just picked up yeah Read it out Aww. to the frog. Read it out to the frog. Read it, Mom. Read it all. It's from Diane and Bill. She says she likes to watch our vlogs every morning, having coffee and breakfast with her husband. Anyway, her husband does. Oh, she got these this for me. Cinnamon. <laughs> He makes these cinnamon roasted nuts, and so he sells them at craft fairs. So I'm gonna try them. I'm very what is this? Ew. There's almonds, pecans, walnuts. Ooh. Ooh. Let's try the pecans. You want to? 
I do not. Thank you so much. Sterling, you want to try one of these? Oh, there's another one. So there's pecans, almonds, walnuts, and more pecans. So we're going to try. Hold on, baby. You don't want to try one? Mm-hmm. Her husband makes these and sells them. You wanna try one? So good. Try one. Try one. Remember you had them like at the um Renaissance? Me. <laughs> These are awesome. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -mm. You want to try one? Mm-mm. Oh, good. Me and Daddy will eat them all. Those are so good. I'm going to put this thing back on it. Hold on. I'm going to try it. I'm gonna try almond. <laughs> and then I wanna try walnuts. No, stop trying them all. Why? They are so good. Those are good. Yeah. They're pecans. I'm gonna put them back. Bond. In a minute. And I have a bunch of rings going on my fingers. You are. Cause nobody's gonna put them back on, and I stole them. Her rings. Roll, roll, roll your butt. up. They're all really good. Just saying. Look at that. I can probably eat the whole thing right now. <laughs> so thank you, Bill. Thank you so much. I mean to. Alright. Open it. Let me help you. Dee 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 dee. There's another layer. It keeps on going. <gasps> oh my goodness. Look how cute. <laughs> A Look how cute Where this I is. Oh, he's so cute. There's another one. Let's see what this one looks like. What the word? Aww. What? It's so white. <laughs> so cute. These little chubby chickens. Thank you so much. That is so sweet. And those are awesome. Absolutely. Absolutely awesome. Can you leave it alone here? Can you grab those that you put on the ground? Thank you, Diane and Bill. Where do these all fit on my windowsill? If not, I'll put them over on my shelf. They're so cute. So I think we're gonna do... <laughs> Please show up. I gotta go post a video real quick too. I think we're gonna do school. And then after school. Well, actually right now. Can you want? I'm resetting this. I'm resetting. I got that from a thrift store too. Okay, well, hold on. The note. Hey. You want this? I'm resetting it. It's all. What up, girlfriend?
Why are you not sitting on your egg? Mom, open it. Ouch, it's on my head. Yeah, put it on. Where's, where is it? Is that it? Let me hold it. Don't drop it. Let's see if I hear any more. I want to hear your eggs. Hold on, Mama. Trying to see if there's any more hatching out. I hear them. Is it a boy or a girl, Mom? We don't know. Hopefully it's a girl. Did you like girls? I don't see numbers. It's moving. It's moving. Hey! Get, up. Get away. It's I'm trying so to see if these eggs are hatching. Look. Ew. <gasps> that one's hatching. Gross. It, I thought that was hatching. This one is. No, you're not gonna grab them. Huh? Go over that way for a minute. Okay, I just want to check them, girls. Oh. <laughs> Where do I set the baby? Mm -hmm. I set her. She's grabbing them. I want to listen. There you go, Mom. I put the baby there. Wait, actually, the baby might get hurt. Can you give me the baby? Hold she on, I'm trying to see if any of these are cheaping. Yay. Yay. And ma'am. <laughs> She's taking all the eggs. Mom. How, how sweet is her? The girls just want to be mamas because they have one baby. Hey guys, so we're having fajitas for dinner. Anyway, so we go because I'm like, I want to check the peel box. And Jeremy's like, can we go to the thrift store? And I was like, we, well, yeah, might as well. So, we go to the thrift store. I bought that. Dad, you want? That feeder. Dad. It was three bucks because it's three dollars for a top and three dollars for a bottom at Tractor Supply. And here I just get the, you know. Mm -hmm. And we got babies coming, so. Mm -hmm. I'm like, okay. And then, uh, I still want to go by the Dollar, uh, dollar General. Mm-hmm. But then I was like, okay, well, I'll just, I decided I was going to treat myself to Starbucks. Mm -hmm. So we go in there, and we stand there, and like, there's a bunch of people, and there's like probably, how many workers were there? Three or four? Yeah. There were three or four workers. Mm -hmm. And so, you know, I These walk up. Almonds. I walk up. You said walnuts. These are almonds. I walk ah! up to the counter. I walk up to the counter, and like, she's just standing there, but she's like, not Sharing. like not really paying attention mm -hmm. and I'm like so I'm standing like that and she's like she didn't even make eye contact with you <laughs> you're just like what are you waiting on well and then I'm like well and I look at the screen and there's nothing on there and I'm like well maybe their computer system is down so I just stand there and then they're like and then the boy come over again <laughs> like, so then people start stacking up behind me and I'm just like and then finally she's like what would you like and I'm like get out much I know right and I'm like I don't know I, I mean how long did we I stand there five minutes I stand there a good bit because I was like fixing to leave because I was like this is ridiculous I'm like you are not very good at customer service. I'm just gonna put this 
But it was like she was just, you know, I don't know. Anyway, yeah, we got us some Starbucks. Ooh. I don't know what she was. Did you feed Aberdeen? Okay. Hey. I'm gonna use all of this onion. That's a strong onion. Places, it's like you get ignored by the waitresses. Yeah. I mean, it's like. That's why I felt like I was just being. Good as anybody else's. Being ignored. Well, was it good? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yeah
I thought, well, let me go check to see if it's born. And if not, you know, I'll try to assist a little bit. Um, by assisting, I'll just like kind of crack, you know, try to help crack around and then put it back down and it can <laughs> do the rest itself. So I started to do that and I'm like, it's not moving. And so I went ahead and, you know, got it all the way out. It, it's, it was dead. It didn't have any life whatsoever. Um, so journey was sad, but that's, you know, it just happens, you know, and you know, you might have 10 chicks and you know, you might lose two, three, you might even lose half of them. But, um, anyway, we'll see if any more comes about. There's, they're sitting, sitting on more and I candle lit them by candlelit. I meant I use my phone light to look. There might be one or two, um, there was a couple other ones I just ended up tossing them because you can tell they're just liquid in there and at this point in time there would not be liquid sloshing around in it unless it's a rotten egg and so and there was a couple that looked like they were just starting with the veining um, with like you know you can see red veins um, so you know that, the, those might develop but if I might still, because I even thought about it, I was like, if I go and get like four chicks at Tractor Supply and stick them underneath them, you know, maybe. I don't know. I just don't know. So, yeah, we'll, we'll see what happens. And then I'm like, you know, I can even stick more <laughs> eggs under them in, in three weeks from now. Because we've had chickens sit on eggs. This one chicken, I swear, was like sitting on eggs like all spring, like for months at a time. That was actually... That was actually the black... She was uh, the one that's half black Asian in Bienum. But anyway... Um, and so maybe we'll have chicks eventually, but not in the next day or so. Um, <clears throat> so I'm getting ready to work. I had to mes message a customer, um, because I need a size 6 shirt and I do not have one to make her order on. But they'll be in, not tomorrow, but the next day. Meantime, I have these shirts right here that I have to work on, so I'm going to start working on those. I was just, you guys, it's like, I need more time. I need more time in my day to accomplish all the things I need to accomplish. And I need time to do the stuff I want to do, do the stuff I need to do, and do the stuff I have to do. Done. So, like, I want to edit vlogs, and I want to, you know, feed my sourdough, and I want to make sourdough, and I want to, you know, I want to do all that stuff. And what I need to do, I need to, like homeschool, you know, Journey and Sterly, and I need to, like, clean my house, and I need to cook dinner, and, you know, I need to work on these orders, and what I want to do is just take a nap or go to the thrift store. <laughs> I can't do all that. So, anyway, it is 7.41, and I'm just going to work until I feel like I'm done. Hopefully, it'll be... I'll get a majority of these shirts done. If not, I can finish them tomorrow. We don't have anything going on tomorrow. No appointments, nothing. Um, and my... My fingers are horrible. Horrible. Uh, I'm like, it must be a hormonal thing. Oh, that's another thing. I bought lighters. They're upstairs. I need to get them. I use lighters to burn my ribbons. Um, but yeah, like my skin, I don't know, yeah, you can see, it is just like peeled off. So I'm just going to have to call the dermatologist and let them know. Did I even mention that they were trying me on some other medicine? They gave me like 
a sample. The, the doctor, you know, told the nurse to go get, you know, get her the sample of this blah, blah, blah. And if it works, then, you know, we can work on getting you a prescription. She's like, it's just harder to get covered by insurance, but, you know, there's a way to go about it that where we could get it covered. And so, I'm like, okay, well, it doesn't work. I mean, granted, I only used it for like, I don't know, three, four days, but it said put it on twice a day. So I made sure I put it on twice a day, but I'm like, if I would have used this cream, this is when I had cracks. This is like pretty much my skin is peeled off. Um, but when I had the cracks, it probably, if I would have used a steroid, obviously it's a steroid, it probably works better than, you know, a non-steroid. But I'm like, if I would have used that, it would be gone already. But now, like last night, I was calling asleep and I was like, I need to put my cream on. But I was just too tired to get up and go get it. So, here I am. And I'm just putting putting it on with a little band-aid over top. That way it can really soak in. But anyway, fajitas were delicious. Um, I don't do anything special for fajitas. It's pretty much the, um, the meat that you buy for fajitas. The pre-cooked, all that jazz. That way it's easy and I don't have to worry about cooking I mean obviously I cooked it but you know what I mean I don't have to worry about fully cooking my meat because it's already cooked so basically I just put it in a pan warm it up I saute my vegetables and we just do onions and green peppers so I saute those up in a pan till they're soft and then I add my meat that has already been, you know, warming up and cooking. And then um, add my fajita mix, seasoning mix. And then we serve it up. And we like our fajitas with sour cream, cheese, and then we add like tomatoes and avocados, but we didn't have any avocados. So we kind of make it like a taco, but you know, with fajita meat and fajita vegetables. But it's so good, it's so darn good. My husband's like, this is so good. Like, yeah. But anyway, thank you, Diane and Bill, again, for the tasty um, cinnamon roasted nuts because they are delicious. My husband had some. And he was like, these are so good. <laughs> and uh, I was like, yeah, I pretty much ate one of them by myself earlier. <laughs> I did. Not gonna lie. But And thank you for the cute little chickens. They're so cute. I'm trying to figure out where to put them. I don't know if they'll fit on my windowsill. I'm looking up here because I have these two windowsills, but they're really small, so they wouldn't fit up there. Anyway, I have to get to work. I'm going to put on a little YouTube. You guys, I'm just... I'm having a time. So, I... And all of this time, I only have two shirts to, you know, show for the amount of time that I work off. And my battery is going to die because my battery is always dying. I ordered batteries today, so they'll be in on Saturday. So this is probably going to die. Uh, but anyway, I messed up so many I messed up two orders so far even though uh, I don't know I don't have a shirt for one so now I'll have to go to Hobby Lobby to get a shirt tomorrow because I done messed up the shirt put a big old hole in it mm -hmm. and then the other one I re I read it wrong it was supposed to be a three t-shirt with a number four on it and I made a four t-shirt with a number three on it and didn't realize it until after it was done so I wasted the entire time stitching it out and wasted a shirt I'm like Mandy's like 
that's when it's time to go to bed and start fresh tomorrow. <laughs> and so when I went upstairs and told my husband, he said the same thing. He was like, just go to bed. <laughs> I'm like, that's what Mandy told me. <laughs> He's like, just go to bed. And, you know. So I'm going to package up the two orders that I got done. And um, we're going to get up in the morning and go to Hobby Lobby. Get the shirt so I can remake this. And... That's all I can do. Luckily, they don't need it until May. The shirt, they didn't need it. said need by date. It was May 10th. So, that's a good thing. And then I'm like, I don't even know if I have any more fabric for the number. Because it's a specific fabric. And I did just order some online. So, anyway. Boy, he's chasing flies. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Bye, guys.